We've got uh, Tanya Kapoor on the phone line with her next question. Hi, Tanya. Welcome to the show. What would you like us to help you with? Hi, I'm looking for a place in Gurgaon. My budget is around 4 crores and this will be for investment. So, I'm looking forward to your suggestion. Okay, uh, you'd send us a mail with some projects shortlisted. Would you like us to cover those or and give you some other options as well? Uh, those would be good and if you have any other, those would also be welcome. Okay, four crores. Like you said, today is a day of a good budget. Uh, so yeah, I think four crores is a fantastic budget. Uh, yeah, and 2.5 crores in Vikroli. In Vikroli. So, uh, I think a uh, very good budget. I would recommend you to look at two investments instead of one. Uh, since you're going to make two investments, you could uh, hedge your bets by buying one plotted development and one apartment complex. Uh, I'll share with you some key data points first that that will make you uh, that basically reiterate that these markets are still looking very good. Uh, in the apartment side, 27 projects, total supply 10,000 units, availability is only of 1285 units, inventory over rank is eight months. This is in the golf course extension road. With respect to product development, seven projects only, total supply of 1123 units and the inventory overhang is eight months. If you look at the weighted average price in this market, 8,225 rupees a square feet is the price of apartments and weighted average price of plotted development on Gurgaon, a golf course extension road is 65,000 rupees a square feet. Uh, sorry, 65,000 rupees a square yard. Uh, if you're looking at the price appreciation trends, whopping 60%, that's about 28-29% analyzed for apartments in Gurgaon and plotted development is about 68%, which is roughly about 35 or 33 to 34% on no, an I, analyzed I, I basis. I these price appreciations and I got to stop here and ask you this. I mean, uh, we've been talking about Gurgaon market and last time you said this is the only time when I'm. it's not looking like my favorite market for the simple reason that the prices have shot up so much. I mean, this is a lot. That's precisely why I was saying that, that I think this, these appreciation trends are not about to continue in the long run or in even the short run for that matter. But there are still certain hidden gems out there. Mm -hmm. And earlier you could, you know, you could just throw a dart on anywhere on the Gurgaon map and you'd get 40% appreciation. Yeah. Now you have to be picky and choosy and you have to know the weighted average price. You need to understand inventory to make the right decision to continue to make good returns. Okay. Uh, otherwise, you could be stuck and you could make fixed deposit kind of returns in Gurgaon going forward. Uh, I will come to the projects that we recommend for you. Some of them are the ones that you had shortlisted, but quickly on the shortlisted ones that you had sent to us, La Lagune, uh, Province Estate and Presidia, uh, we do not recommend Province Estate and La Lagoon. Uh, this is because already La Lagoon has become quite pricey and it's not that well known in the golf course road. There are better projects on the golf course road. It's trading at 12 to 12 and a half thousand rupees a square feet. Uh, province Estate, 8,950 rupees a square feet. Minimum size is 5,800 square feet. They're trying to copy the Ralias model. It's not on a high end road, so I would not recommend that. And Presidia, Pioneer Urban, that's a very good project. That is something that you could actually look at. It's 8,250 rupees a square feet. But we have some recommendations that are slightly cheaper also. But on the luxury side, you could look at this property definitely. But one recommendation that we'd like to make on the apartment side is Sky Terraces by MRMGF because it's trading at 64, 6,500 rupees a square feet and the structure is already up. So if you're going to look at golf course extension, might as well buy a cheaper property uh, with, with the same amenities and specifications rather than paying 2,000, 3,000 rupees a square feet more premium although you'll have to pick this up from the resale market. Uh, with respect to plotted development, Whipple World on Sona Road still looking good, 60,000 rupees a square yard. Uh, prices in and around Sona Road now with uh, plotted developments have touched, like for example, South City 2 has touched 75,000 to 1 lakh rupees a square yard. So you could look at this. And there's a new development that's come up very far away, long term, but 28,000 rupees a square yard, 13 kilometers from Sona Road. This is launched by Raheja, it's called Raheja Araya. And this property is a long-term bet because you're getting it at a very low rate. A uh, lot of expectations on development in that area are still, they have still have to be met by the government though. So that's the disclaimer. All right, so lots of research really, Tanya, gone for your questions. So out of the three projects that you have shortlisted, two have been basically said to be not great projects or at least on the pricing front there are better options available these are your options there's presidia pioneer by urban pioneer urban land there's also sky terraces palm drive by emar mgf there's whipple world 
by Vipul developers. These are plotted areas. And then if you go out further, 13 kilometers on Sona Road, you have Raheja, Aranya, Green City by Raheja developers. Okay, so that was a lot of Gurgaon market and why you have to be very careful about what you pick in this market. Within the same localities, there's a difference of two to two and a half thousand rupees per square foot in projects. And that essentially is a 25 to 30 percent premium for some projects. Those ones aren't going to go up until unless they deliver something fantabulous in terms of quality of construction and facilities. Branding has started to play a big role in real estate, which was not the case earlier. Okay. So uh, a, a good developer is being able to demand a premium of 20 25 percent. And we're seeing that across tier one series. Uh, why we're recommending MRMGF is because the construction is already uh, more or less 70 percent there. Mm -hmm. So there is not that much of an execution mm -hmm. risk. And HDFC is running a subvention scheme over there. Okay. So those are some of the projects in Gurgaon. If you've got a big fat budget, uh, we're going to come back. We're going to take more of your questions. Call us at the numbers flashing on your screen. Write into us at property at NDTV.com. Emails are very helpful because they actually give a lot of details of what you want us to research on and help our team as well to get to know you better. So get to that as well. Coming up next, why are fund houses shying away?